There are many children who have experienced trauma. When children have experienced trauma or the effects of very strong, stressful events, it can challenge their sense of security and cause them to feel helpless. Trauma can be due to interactions with people or situations. Caring adults naturally want to ease the impact of these stressful and traumatic events. Of course, it's important to seek the advice of the child's doctor or counselor when a child has sustained trauma. While G2's Please Play program is not a trauma treatment program, it is a child-directed play program that fosters emotional and psychological well-being in young children. Following the Please Play model, child-directed play with a safe, attuned, and consistent adult provides a caring relationship which is known to be a vital step towards healing in children with trauma. Currently, trauma during the COVID-19 pandemic is a shared trauma. It crosses all social, economic, and ethnic boundaries. Families are enduring feelings of isolation and stress as regular patterns of life have changed at home, work, and school. G2 in the home, or Please Play, is a simple child-directed play experience that offers a rest from many of the effects of the COVID-19 pandemic. In general, Please Play may strengthen the child by creating fun, decreasing stress, supporting coping, and allowing hope. Parents and caretakers enjoy a brief and powerful break as they take 20 or 30 minutes to rest and play with their young child. In play with a child, one can notice a child's style. This is true of children with trauma. As a clinical psychologist, I've noticed some children use play to become more aware of and identify their feelings and to understand their experiences. They may tell their story of their experiences through a character. Playing out a character in a scene can help them understand their feelings and experiences and to feel more in control. Some children use play to explore and practice difficult or uncomfortable feelings like fear or anger. Becoming comfortable with these emotions allows children to more effectively cope in challenging situations. Some children are changeable, calm some days and highly reactive other days. Their big feelings can disrupt their connection to themselves and their family members. For these children, play can be calming and connecting. Overall, during self-directed play, attuned, consistent adults provide a safe relationship for children to connect and express their experiences and emotions, which supports healing, coping, and smoothly regulating one's emotions and behaviors. Well-regulated children are more able to calmly navigate learning in school and social interactions with peers and at home. They may develop more resilience in managing themselves during stressful life experiences, now and in the future.